Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and we talk about Focus Assist. In Windows 11, Focus Assist, like in Windows 10, is there to create a set of rules so that some things like notifications will not actually interfere with what you're doing. So if you right click on the start menu and go into settings, you will of course have focus assist. Now, when I talked about notifications earlier, you could see that focus assist was also part of it because notifications and focus assist are kind of, you know, uh, mixed together in how they work. So focus assist, what it has is the possibility to stop the notifications from interfering with something you're doing. Could be work, gaming, and so on. So how does it work? So first of all, the first part of Focus Assist is off, meaning it never actually works, does anything. Priority only, which means only selected apps, selected notifications will actually go through in any case. And alarms only means that you don't have notifications, but if you have alarms, they will go through. And you, of course, can click show a summary of what I missed when focus assist was on, which means it will actually, when you get back to normal, tell you, you missed this, you missed that, you missed a call, you missed a notification from this app, and so on. Rules. So you have times when the rules are on. You can choose a set of times when there's nothing on and only priority will actually be there. So that means if you turn on this calendar time or this time of day, basically, uh, this period of time, if you want, that means you won't have anything show up unless there's priority only apps. And of course, here you see customized priority list, which means it gives you what you want to customize. First, incoming calls, reminders, like for example, uh, any reminders for a um, an appointment, for example, stuff like that. But you can add contacts if someone wants to talk to you. You can add what apps will have their own, um, you know, priority. And of course, you can remove any apps that you don't want to have in the priority list. For example, Xbox Game Bar does not have to be in the priority list. Snipping tool, uh, nearby sharing, stuff like that. You don't need that necessarily. So you add an app or you, of course, choose an app that already exists. And this app can be from your computer or if you have a compatible phone, an app from your phone. When I'm duplicating my display, it says on. What does that mean? It says alarms only. And if you click, it will bring you what you want to see. So that means if you are on a, having uh, your display on a second screen, or if you have your display on two screens at the same time, you can choose between alarms only or priority only so that you don't get bothered all the time by what's not important. You have when I'm playing a game, priority only. Once again, that tells you if you don't want to be, um, you know, bothered while you're playing games with notifications uh, that are not important, you can choose which ones are and not uh, important. And then when I'm using an app in full screen mode only, for example, right now, to give you an idea, focus assist is actually working. You see, I've got a little moon here says focus assist on is because every time I start a screen recording everything except priority is going to be shut down so it doesn't interfere with my recording for the YouTube video so that gives you an idea of what is important or not so focus assist is there to actually create rules and of course once again, I have to remind you, because you might be saying, well, there's all these rules, but how about turning it off? 
Well, what you want is simply put your apps at off. And that means instead of focus assist rules, you'll go to notifications. And here you'll turn off everything. That means nothing will go through. Nothing will ever bother you. So that's why focus assist is in the same section as notifications because that's where it has an effect. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching our videos.